All that heavy rain we saw over the last few days triggered a number of sewage spills across western Washington. King 5's Kelly Greenberg takes us to some of the contaminated areas where people are being advised to keep out. It was a record downpour, now leaving behind a wave of filth. Several waterfronts are closed, all contaminated by sewage. It's closed. It's like unbelievable. Mari Kubo was walking her dog Gus at Medina Beach Park, where the waterfront is closed because waste from the Medina pump station overflowed into Lake Washington. <coughs> yeah. These two say it's they're okay. keeping their distance. It's all right. He's a lab, so I think he might. He might like to run in, but yeah, we're not going to try that today. <laughs> Another time, maybe. <laughs> In addition to Medina Beach Park, health departments have also issued at least two other closures, the largest being the Port Washington Narrows near Bremerton. That sewage spill contained more than 15,000 gallons of waste. It led Kitsap County Health Department to issue a no contact advisory. And no one's allowed to enter Saltwater State Park. A sign outside calls it an emergency closure. The rain caused the nearby Midway Sewer District to overflow. The waste contaminated the waterfront, but it also created pools in the lower spots of the park. Officials saying people should avoid all three spots because they'll be closed for several days. Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.